In Spinsters, Pagan Kennedy examines the lives of unmarried women, or spinsters, throughout history and in contemporary society. Through her analysis of literature, social norms, and personal anecdotes, Kennedy argues that the spinster is a complex and often misunderstood figure. One of the central themes in Spinsters is the tension between societal expectations and individual desires. Kennedy traces the history of the spinster from the Middle Ages, when single women were often accused of witchcraft, to the 19th century, when they were seen as unfulfilled and pitiable. Today, she argues, spinsters are still stigmatized, but many women are choosing to remain unmarried and embrace the freedom and independence it affords them. Throughout the essay, Kennedy draws on a range of literary examples to explore the ways in which spinsters have been portrayed in popular culture. She notes that the figure of the spinster is often presented as either a tragic victim or a comical caricature, with little room for nuance. However, she argues that spinsters can be complex and multidimensional characters, as demonstrated by works such as Charlotte Bronte's Jane Eyre and Edith Wharton's The House of Mirth. Kennedy also explores the ways in which spinsters have been represented in film and television, arguing that these media often perpetuate negative stereotypes. She cites examples such as the crazy cat lady trope and the portrayal of spinsters as bitter and lonely. However, she notes that there are some positive examples, such as the character of Miss Marple in Agatha Christie's novels, who is depicted as intelligent, capable, and independent. In addition to analyzing literature and media, Kennedy draws on personal anecdotes to illustrate the challenges and rewards of living as a spinster. She recounts her own experiences of being single in her thirties and forties, and the societal pressures she faced to conform to traditional gender roles. She also discusses the experiences of other women, including her mother, who chose to remain unmarried and pursue careers instead of settling down with a husband and children. One of the most compelling arguments Kennedy makes in Spinsters is that being a spinster is not necessarily a negative or pitiable status. She notes that unmarried women can find fulfillment and joy in their friendships, careers, and hobbies, and that they are not defined by their lack of a romantic partner. She also challenges the assumption that spinsters are all alike, arguing that there is no one spinster lifestyle and that each woman's experiences are unique. In conclusion, Pagan Kennedy's Spinsters is a thoughtful and nuanced exploration of the lives of unmarried women. Through her analysis of literature, media, and personal experience, Kennedy challenges the negative stereotypes that have been attached to spinsters throughout history and argues for a more complex and nuanced understanding of the figure. Ultimately, she suggests that spinsters can lead fulfilling and meaningful lives, and that society should not judge them based on their marital status.